Hi folks, it's John Eisman from LastChanceAutoStore.com and today I'd like to give you a useful tip um, about tire pressures on Volkswagens. Um, a lot of times we, we run across problems or concerns um, about people that are having concerns with uh, the front steering or the feel of the front steering on their Beetle um, or Carmen Ghia for that matter being uh, the lighter front ends. Um, so we've got basically three different wheels and tires set up here. Uh, we've got one here on Martha. Uh, these are an aftermarket wheel with a larger Goodyear tire. Uh, we come over to this other convertible. Um, these are more of the stock style, uh, other than they, they're white lettered, but they're, uh, they're authentic in the narrower tires. And then you'll see this particular Beetle here on Kermit, where they're low profile, more of a performance tire. Regardless of what size of, um, of tires you have on your Beetle, the most common thing that we find at Last Chance Auto Store is people are not following or paying attention to what the tire pressure should be. So unfortunately what we find a lot is people I think are referring to the sidewall of the tire and it will have a maximum PSI rating. For example, on these Goodyear LS tires, printed on the side it says maximum PSI is 35. If you have 35 PSI pressure in your front and rear tires on your Beetle, it is going to be scary to drive and, in my opinion, not safe. Um, Volkswagen, they, they print um, in, in various locations, like in the owner's manuals, which obviously are long gone in most cases. Um, there's also a label on inside the glove box door. Most times they're missing also. But if you're running, and it doesn't matter what size or style of wheel or tire you're running on your Volkswagen, the PSI for the front tires, Volkswagen recommends 19 PSI, and for the rear tires is 27 PSI. Now we've done some experiments. We've, we've uh, run different tire pressures, and what we find to work the best is 20 pounds in the front and 28 pounds in the back. Um, it doesn't matter if you're running bias ply or like all three of these Volkswagens in front of you here that are radials, the recommendation is the same. Um, so it's really important because Kermit, for example, that Kawasaki green Volkswagen, with the lowered suspension and the firmer ride, um, unfortunately when, when it was sent to get an alignment done, the garage set all the tire pressures at 35 PSI. I didn't go very far down the road before I felt it. Every time there's a little pothole, it was, I guess you'd call it squirrely. It was all over the place and it was almost scary in terms of handling. Um, so I immediately pulled off the side of the road, used my trusty tire pressure gauge and noticed it was way out. So once again, what we like to do is no more than 20 pounds in the front. So 18, 19 or 20 in the front is ideal and the back 27 or 28 pounds. So personally, for the last couple of years, any one of these bugs that I've driven, um, I like to have about 20 in the front, 28 in the back. And that seems to work really well. Um, so that's basically our tip of the day. Um, and I'm John Eisman from LastChanceAutoStore.com. Um, if you'd like to contact me, my email address is john at LastChanceAutoStore.com. And thanks for watching.